people are out. Beautiful flowers. Mist. With a cooling effect. Because it is hot today. August 5th. And you can see the traffic. That's what it's usually like down here. There's some people waiting across the street even. You gotta wait for everything. Approaching the falls. Trying to get to the Fury. Get over here. Cut in front. And there's Edgewater. Riverview restaurant. Edgewater. Well, Edge Edgewater's is the bar and grill. I guess Riverview is the restaurant now, they call it. There's another story right there. There's where the uh, illumination lights come from. We're going to take a little good look at that. Now, we're approaching Table Rock and there. The horseshoe falls with all the people. The last drive through we did, there wasn't many people. It was early. This is high season. And everybody's out in full force. There's the horseshoe there. We're coming up, approaching there's the table rock where the fury is. And it is open. But we're going down here to park. This is what you do. Table rock. Zoom by the table rock. And we're moving pretty good today. Usually you can't, it's deadly. light here see now they're parking here that's 20 bucks park here but we don't do that you can that's right at the table rock right at the horseshoe falls we go down a little bit further and you'll see the difference And there is my barrel that I will attempt to go over the falls today in. Right there. I will attempt to go over the falls in about 20 minutes. And there is my vehicle. Wish me luck. There's a regular channel going into the river. Now, see what happens when you get out there? picks up a bit in momentum. That's the speed and the power. The upper river, right at the brink. That's just about at the brink. So are we. We're going to the Fury. Here's that channel from the uh, old Ontario Power Station. It's coming in and meeting the river right up near it the brink. And that's the speed of the water in the upper river where the barge was the old scow you see our stories on the scow and you'll look that up the old Niger barge the old Niger scow there it is lodged on the rocks and that's uh, Red Hill I had to deal with that in it personally hand over hand on the uh, lifelines he won the Carnegie uh, life-saving medal by the way Red Hill for saving those two guys off that scow that night. Check out the scow story. There's a duck. A nervy duck. A daredevil duck. And there's where it meets the river and that's the speed of that river and the power. And for you uh, daredevil ducks, read that. No. Climbing over the railing. It's not even allowed, my friends. Just in case you had that in mind. Uh, don't do it. That's a sheer drop right into the upper Niagara right at the brink. Okay, that's what that sign means. There's my foot. And you get about 10 foot. And you are in the water. And then, you know, 
gently float downstream. So over there. There it is. Cool, nice and cool down here. Nice breeze. But you see that? We're right on the edge. And you gotta watch it here too because you gotta beware of changing water levels and believe me, that changes fast. Right to there. Yeah, that is a good idea. Look how close we are to the brink. Look at all the people. Beautiful summer day, August 5th it is, 2008. Looking at the flowers. And you can have dinner right up there, overlooking the falls in the Table Rock restaurant. It was a good view of right at the brink of the falls today.